course, you can argue that we are only effectively at half-time, but as things stand, one team is certainly seemingly more destined for the final than the other. Well, the watchword is complacency, Peter, and frankly, it would be astonishing for them to implode having placed themselves in such a good position. This should be a game to remember rather than one to forget. That's what I'm expecting, at least. Everton, lovely ball into real chance, and again, points there. A game of thrills, all square in the blinking of an eye. Well, going behind has simply triggered a collective determination to hit back, and they merit nothing less. Not so much sophistication as doggedness and sheer bloody-mindedness. Listen, he would have been advised to do that as a kid, and it's obviously etched in his mind now. That's been... And the shot! Dispatched clinically! They've done it! It was coming! They have their reward! A pretty simple finish in the end. What do you think, Jim? Yeah, I really can't say enough as to how good the final ball was. It took the defence out of the equation for that split moment, and the damage was all done. likely to need his best there and he found it oh, it's come loose Bruno Enrique it's in and that looks to me very much like an own goal well that wasn't in the script and you have to feel for him Peter it's ended in uh, some embarrassment Chance to break. Jason gets away from a great chance. Surely this time. Yes! And the lead is three. It is surely done. Sharpness, swiftness, opportunism. A poacher's finish. Well, I admire players who do that because they just don't give up on anything. Rapidly approaching the end. They have one foot in the final. And it did Bruno Enrique! And somehow he's managed to miss it. Bruno Enrique worked a lovely solo run and effort, Peter. He should go solo again for me.